win? Are you pleased with how the how the team has bounced back uh, from the loss this week? Yeah, I think we we practice well. I think the guys understand that you know the season's not over by no means. Uh, a lot of teams got to play a lot of games. You know, we play probably more than anybody SEC games than anybody in the conference. So uh, that bit some other teams to get some losses. So we we got still a lot to play for. Two very different losses: one blowout, one close. One is one more difficult to come back from than another. Well, anytime you lose, it's, it's difficult. And uh, you know, again, when you you get blown out, I guess you know you got to figure out what's what's really wrong. And now that you played a close ball game, you just uh, that's a few things that you just have to zone in on. So that's what we try to do. What can you take from those first three and a half quarters? Well, we got a chance. If we play four, we'll be pretty good. Does that make it more frustrating, though, knowing how close you were and how you really played so well all game? Well, the frustrating part is about how we finished. And again, it's not about how we finished uh, just that game. We didn't finish the Vander game. We, we, we're not finishing. And so that's something that we talked about this week. And uh, we also address we don't start fast. We got to start fast. And uh, so we got to stop teams and not let them score on the first drive. So that's been the focus this week of uh, starting the game off and uh, playing fast and then finishing the game. How was Bryson's arm? Bryson's fine. Bryson's fine. Uh, I think it gets better every day. And, you know, sometimes he, he hit it in, in the ball game and, and it becomes real tender. So, you know, a kid's got a lot of courage to be out playing. Any big changes related to what you did last week in terms of personnel? Uh, DJ Smith is going to uh, be at safety. DJ Smith and uh, uh, TJ Girl will start at safety. We're going to start DJ at the, the uh, free safety spot. We're trying to get a more physical guy that, you know, when, you know, Chaz did a good job of, of showing range, but I want a guy that's going to go over there and, and make some contact when he get there. So uh, we're going to look at DJ Smith. He's a physical guy, and we've been playing him in the post all week. So we'll see how well he does it. But other than that, Marquise Roberts still start at Mike Linebacker, and the rest of the guys will be the same. Have you all uh, y'all been working DJ at the safety spot as well um, over the course of the season? Oh, yeah, yeah. He, he, he started out at safety, and then he moved a corner when we – uh, young guy was, wasn't playing as well, so now he's back. So he's already had some safety work. He had it in, during our camp. Well, I, mean, I think you said before the season started, you anticipated the linebackers being the, the strength of the defense. Have they played kind of up to your expectations? Or? Well, I think all position has been up and down. Uh, you know, I, I think now that we, we're, we're starting to play more cohesively and better as a team, the linebackers are starting to shine a little more. But I, you know, I, they should be. Because they're the guys that had the most experience coming back with starts, and and uh, but you still they're they're still a young group. You know, you're talking about a lot of sophomores and true sophomores. So, you know, I couldn't put a lot of heavy expectation on them, but I think they're they're starting to grow into that role now. Are they making as many plays as you thought they would? Uh, again, we it, it depends on the game. Uh, you know, I thought they did when we played a physical team that ran the ball in the box like Georgia and, and in Vanderbilt, and then of course spread teams that don't have a lot of opportunities. But you know, I think I thought we played pretty well against uh, you know knowing that. Seeing that uh, you know, our last opponent was a spread team, I thought they made some plays in space. I think Deke said that uh, Deion Green is going to play a little defensive end this week with some of the injuries. Is that what, what, what does he bring to the table with that position? You know, that's why he came here as a DN, and uh, you know he's he been back and forth trying to gain weight to play some three technique, and he's done that, done that. But Deion was recruited here to play DN, and and he'll play some DN in this ball game because we lost you know Cooper and David Johnson. Big concern for you with the injuries at that position. Or? Well, it's not a concern. If we didn't have the three-four packet, then we'd be a concern. Uh, now that we got, we can play three-four, and and we play a lot of it, then you know we can get through a ball game with just having really one in on the field. And has Gerald looked okay the last couple of days of practice? Yeah, Gerald's done well. You know, Gerald's a smart young man, and uh, you know if anybody can miss practice and come in and play, it'll be Gerald Dix. He's because he's a smart guy. Right. Coach, Thank